It is graduation time for many college students all across the country and right here in Kentucky. Anna Spalding University is especially excited because they are graduating students from new programs and sending a class out into the workforce to do some great, great things. Spalding University President Tori McClure joins us now here in the Great Day Live studio. It's always great to have you back in here. <laughs> is this like your first visit back in you know, since we've reopened to guests? I, it's certainly, an, oh, I think Tori, it is. Oh, yeah. Tori, yeah, awesome, yeah, really welcome. Right. Yeah, we have six commencements this week. I was gonna say, what a busy we're, week you we're have. Still doing little, you know, COVID friendly commencements and we start tomorrow for two and then two on Friday and two on Saturday and events all mixed in. So I'm going to, you know, <laughs> Pace I've, yourself. Got, I've got my, I've got my uh, endurance built up. But you so got your running shoes on. Yeah, <laughs> you showed up with your running shoes <laughs> and she's going to be running all week long. You know, we mentioned off the top of the show, you know, to have, I mean, the pride you must feel in knowing you're graduating not only an incredible class of this workforce, but um, from new programs to yeah, boot. I mean, it's we've, huge. We've, uh, you know, some of our old programs are fantastic. The mental health issues everyone's facing right now. Spalding's been in that game since the Civil War. Mm. You know, we we really know what we're about, but fighting the stigma of mental health is it's a challenge for all of us. And um, yeah, we've got a new criminal justice program, a new mental health uh, uh, counseling program for uh, schools. And so there are lots of great programs, a lot of health sciences. So our, mm -hmm. our students are having no challenges going out and getting jobs. And so you're always, I think, responding to or ahead of what is next. Well, our mission well, is know. to meet the needs of the times, which I love that part of our mission because we can never cross that finish line. We're right. always looking for what's the next need that we need to meet. The need that you guys have always been ahead of too is college, the cost is so expensive. And I know that, right, we're looking at the way the economy is right now. People are worried about groceries, gas, all the basics. And it's like, wow, college too? You all are, are trying to, to really work hard to make sure that it is affordable. Yeah, the cost of college is a national tragedy. I mean, we do it wrong in the United mm -hmm. States and we are, we are just, we're hurting our future in terms our, of our competitiveness in, in, the, in the world. But Spalding works very hard to keep costs down. We're competitive with most public institutions. And so if a parent really wants a small uh, space where their child's name will be known and that they'll have very close contact with their faculty, they should take a look at Spalding and compare cost. The, the important they things. They might be surprised, <laughs> yeah. Knowing your child's name. Knowing your child's name and where they live and how they're feeling and what's going on. And when we do have a child, well, they're not children anymore, a young adult with with issues, we usually know what's going on mm. and, and, and we know their story, yeah. Talk about employability. With this graduating class, you're confident when you send them out, you're like, yeah. You're they, gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. No worries yeah. The from world you. is waiting for you, <laughs> yeah. And particularly with nurses and teachers and occupational therapists and all the, the health scientists and, and educators and mental health professionals, they'll be fine. They'll be right. fine. And, and they can pay back their student loans, and that's a good thing. Yeah. And, and that's another tragedy yeah. of kind of what's happening, right. I, we feel like, always yeah. in our country, is that the last thing you want to do is send sending these young people out in the world strapped with debt that they're like, wait a minute, I'm making how much? Right. And how am I going to pay off yeah, people, all so that student Colleges loans? are like, well, we, we need more young people. Mm -hmm. It's like, well, young adults aren't having children because they're busy paying off their student loans. Right. Like, and I feel like every time we do catch up with you, there is always something new, not only with regards to programs, but there are, there's always something new happening there on campus too. What's going on? Yeah, well, the biggest change for us is really our, our playing fields on Ninth Street. We opened mm -hmm. these beautiful playing fields and then COVID hit. Yeah. And so we're in NCAA Division III, uh, lots of good things going on. We're not as affected by name, image, and likeness. We're not as affected by all the other challenges. Young people can come and be scholar athletes. Mm -hmm. And, uh, but those, what those was that? What? Scholar, scholar athletes. Wow, scholar whoa, whoa, whoa. Athletes. <laughs> Nice. And, and I really bristle at the notion that you can't be an intellectual and an athlete mm -hmm. at the same time. It is possible. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. so when will a lot of these projects be wrapped up, you think, on campus? You know, we've got a new building for health sciences that should wrap up here in the next couple of months. So we, we're lots of great things going on and lots of online programs because we the world has discovered that yeah. you can 
Be educated in your pajamas. Why not? Yeah, with, why a not? with a cup of coffee. With a cup of coffee. Three o'clock in the morning yeah, if you yeah. need to. Oh, Tori, it's always great catching up with you. Thank, Thank you for you. stopping by. Thanks. I told you we'd get you out of here on time so you can <laughs> run to the 15 million different <laughs> commencement addresses. So we want to let everybody know that uh, if you want to find out more about enrolling at Spalding University and the programs that they offer, by just all you have to do is visit spalding.edu.